Hello, I will now show you the AliExpress app. Uh, this will be a lot clearer than my last video because I am using screen capture on my phone. And besides that, the app itself looks a lot better and more better laid out than the website does. As you can see here, um, just something to keep in mind, normally... I would use this app in portrait mode like this but because of the way that you're watching it on YouTube I know it's not practical to show it like this so to accommodate the way that you're seeing this I'll do it all in landscape mode because this will fill your screen and you will be able to see things better uh, although, just keep in mind, like I, I said, you will probably be doing the same thing if you start using this app on your phone. It's a lot easier to use it in portrait mode. It's a lot easier to hold the phone and manipulate things instead of just trying to do it in landscape mode because it's more of a two-hand affair like this. Anyway, as you can see, this is a home page. <clears throat> and I'll go through it again how to search for a guitar on here. There's already a previous search for electric guitar. Let's do that. And as you can see, there are several. Let's choose this one here, the first one. Tap on that. And I think the tapping noise is really loud when I use my finger. I will switch to using a stylus. Now, as I said before, when you order a guitar, you want to contact the seller, okay? And this seller, I had already asked a question. I asked, how long will it take for this guitar to ship? And the reply was, Hello, Roy, welcome to our shop. We have one to two pieces on painting process. It will be finished soon. We can ship it out in two days after order. Shipping time on the way is about 6 to 10 days, which is about accurate. I'd say more 6 to 14 or 15 days from what I've seen. And <clears throat> so you always want to ask questions like that. How long will it take to get here? Uh, can you send me pictures of the guitar before it is shipped? You only want to do that if you're going to order the guitar. Don't ask for pictures of guitar of a guitar that you're not even ordering because they will say, look, it's not even made yet. You have to order the guitar first. Most of the time it's like that. And besides, it's better if you can get pictures of the guitar while it's in the process of being made because that's really neat. In fact, I'll show that to you in a little bit. <clears throat> we'll just try to get back to the general search. Uh, you know, you can search for different things. There's a really great deal I wanted to tell you about. Now these, I don't know if, if you know what a round back ovation guitar is. Like this. Uh, let's look at pictures. And another thing I want to point out. If there's only one picture of the product, if you scroll down to where it says item description, tap on view all there's mostly always more pictures down in the description they tell you the rest of the details about the item okay a little more info there more pictures here close-up pictures right and uh, this one's kind of funny no white clouds in the real guitar because obviously they took this guitar outside and took pictures and the clouds are reflecting in the finish so I just think that's funny that someone would actually think that. <laughs> but at least they have it in there. And this guitar, I'm showing it to you. Are you in love with it yet? Beautiful top on it. Okay, this is the round back right here. It's uh, a plastic or fiberglass round back. I think there might be a better picture of it. And that's real wood around the sound holes there. Here we go. Now, there's pluses and minuses to this kind of guitar. 
it's gonna sound has more of a flat sound uh the sound projects more than it does with a regular acoustic there's more consistency in that kind of construction than there is trying to bend wood and glue it together and bind it together it it would be a really reliable guitar if you you travel a lot if you uh gig a lot with it because it's really set up for playing electric and it sounds great that way uh nancy wilson from heart uses ovation guitars or she has in the past and that prove that just shows how great they are she if she uses it but i wanted to show you this for a reason okay let's look at the price 192 dollars free shipping and it comes with a free hard case that's pretty cool and you're not going to find a guitar anywhere else for that price with a case at least on aliexpress and there are different finishes there's there's black i think that's black that might be the same kind of blue as the other one it is there's one that's a gray finish that i think is really cool it's down here somewhere natural wood finish oh, that looks great these are all the same with a free case this one looks more like a traditional guitar but it's a a round back it's an ovation round back and of course when i say ovation we're dealing with aliexpress they are copies not real ovation guitars there's another one that looks nice just want to quickly show these because in my mind they're worth seeing this one's a little bit different it only has the holes at the top and there's no uh, trim around them or anything it's a plain stripped down looking guitar which doesn't really look bad to me just wanted to point that out real quick i want to show you a conversation i had with my favorite seller you go to messages let's look at a message i had here about another guitar okay that's the guitar that's getting built for me. I'm going to have to get back to him on the color of that guitar. Rock, beg Rock Beggar, that's a good uh, seller right there. That's his shop. Uh, everything is reasonably priced. You're going to find among the lowest prices there. Lee Ruong, that's my seller there put that up there i'm going to try to go back when you want to go back in history if you've had a long dialogue with a seller you pull down see it says pull down to load more and then release to load more you just keep pulling down and releasing i want to show you what we went through for a guitar that i already ordered It's here somewhere. I had ordered two guitars together. It was a, an Iguana Burst Les Paul along with a PRS. When we get to the pictures, I want to show you the pictures because they are really cool. And this is an example of what you can get if you ask for it. Okay, let's see. I think I went too far back. Instead of getting a, br a brown color it came with, and it was a left-hand model, I got it in a red color. That's what I was telling her there. There's pictures of it when it was made, before they shipped it. You always want to get pictures of it before they ship it, so you can look at it, zoom in close, make sure there's nothing wrong with it actually this isn't the one that i had i was showing her pictures as an example for the one that i want and then i gave her an example of 
the guitar that I wanted made, the green one, the Les Paul, and we went through every detail of it. I told her, this is the one I want, like this. And I don't like the custom headstock because the diamonds are too small on it. I will show you that in the next video when we look at my collection of guitars. So I got a regular standard style Les Paul with this type of headstock on it. I said, let's get this type of headstock that shows it's a custom, but it's still a regular neck, the regular style. And then there's the whole dialogue of going back and forth. What about the pictures? Can I say, you know, do you have the pictures yet? And here's a picture of the Les Paul when it was in its first stage of painting. That's the base coat there. And then there's more, can I get pictures? I was asking her about this guitar. It's a, a Schechter, uh, Sinister, Schechter, Sinister guitar. If it could be done in different colors, and she said, yes, it can be. Uh, just whenever you have, you find something that the seller you're dealing with does not sell, ask them about it. Ask them, look, can you give me this guitar at the same price that this other person is doing? Most likely they'll say yes, but you don't know unless you ask. Here's the PRS before it was sent. And like I was saying, you always want pictures so you can inspect it and make sure it's the way that you wanted it. And what I missed was the truss rod cover was a plain one. It didn't say custom. So she's going to send me the proper truss rod cover with my next guitar that I order from her. You always want to look at the tuners and make sure that they are lined up straight, that they're not crooked. That would be hard to fix later on. You want them to you want to catch it and have them fix it right then and there. There's the Les Paul again. After it's been painted. Looks pretty good. The back of it. See, they sent me lots of pictures because I asked for it. There's pictures of it when it's complete. That's a nice looking guitar and it's right here in front of me and it looks just as good right there. So, yeah, I love it. Uh, really great guitar. Happy with it. But you got to make sure, ask for pictures. Make sure you get the pictures. That's the main thing I'm saying. And that's how you do it. Anyway, just a quick video to show you about this app. Anything that's laid... Okay, on the website, everything that was laid out at the top, it's all right here on the side. All of the different options to choose from and everything. So, that's what makes me say this is a lot cleaner like this. Even if you're doing it in this style here, everything is still right there on the side. And... Just really neat, and don't forget you get app-only discounts on uh, some of the items, some of the guitars that you'll look at. Uh, the one that I'm having made, I purchased for $168, and on the website, it's $178. It's $10 more. So try to always do your shopping, your purchasing from the app, even if go to the home page even if you're uh you can look at it on the website if you want to see bigger pictures and stuff like that but do the purchase itself on the app save what you want to the wish list and then when you go back to in the app look at the item again on the wish list and it will probably come out a little bit cheaper anyway that's a pro tip for you there hope you have fun using the app and let me know if you purchase a guitar or if you have questions while you are in the process of looking for a guitar, let me know in the comments below. Please like and subscribe if you haven't. And give me some feedback. Let me know how I did on this video. Let me know if there's something that you want covered. And definitely let me know about the guitars that you chose to purchase. Send me links or something like that so I can look at them. 
or how you chose to customize them because you can ask for any finish, any kind of uh, top or veneer on the guitar that you want. Don't be afraid to ask. Whatever's in your mind, you can make it come out right here. Just at, talk with the seller. If it's a seller that does not understand English too well, then move on to a different seller. But all these sellers I have mentioned are uh, really great. And I will try to put links to their stores in this video. That's it for now. Take care.